Hello children, how are you doing today? I hope everyone is fit as an elephant because I am going to tell you a story. Um, elephants never forget, you know, that is true. They have a very good memory and they are strong and stout like this one here. So let's assume that it is a story about this elephant. Okay, so the book says it's written by Anushka Ravi Shankar and here goes the story. There was thunder, there was lightning and rain. Toot toot, the elephant trumpeted in fright. Hoot hoot, the wind replied. When it stopped raining and the sun shone, the elephant found he was all alone. He heard a bunch of monkeys natter. They pushed and they pulled, they slid and they swung, they rocked and they rode, they threw and they flung. Crack! A coconut hit him on his head. Enough, thought the elephant, and he fled. He needed some water to wash himself clean. The buffaloes looked so calm, serene. The water was lovely, cool, and green. The elephant thought he could stay with them, maybe even play with them. With a baby buffalo, he tumbled and wellowed. Their frolicking, you know, suddenly came to an end. They were running away. The elephant was sad. Why didn't they like him? Was he smelly? Was he bad? You see there? They are all running. What happened? Let's find out. Oh, the reason they had run was suddenly clear. You see? You see that? Who is that? The elephant trem trembled in fear. He could not move. He was terrified. A buffalo pushed him aside. As they ran away, they took him along. He stayed on with them. He grew big and strong. The elephant cleared the buffalo's path. You see? Like that. Because they are strong. He helped them have a shower bath. You like showers like that? What else did he do? He found them leaves when the grass was dry. You see, because they are tall and they have their trunk, so they can break the leaves from high branches. Now the tiger dared not come by. His ears were too large, his nose was too long, his shape was quite odd and his color was all wrong. He only could trumpet, he could not bellow, yet the elephant liked being a buffalo. As they lazily wallowed in the river one day, some 30, uh, sorry, not 30, thirsty elephants came that way. The buffaloes decided they'd rather not stay. Toot, 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 the elephants called. Bellow, bellow, the buffaloes bawled. Here or there, where should he go? An elephant or a buffalo? Now, that is a very difficult thing to decide, isn't it? And what do you think he decides? But in the end, the answer was plain. You see that? He's going, going, where? Where do you think he went? Hmm, a buffalo he would always remain. You see that? Yes, 
So, if you thought he was going to go away with the elephants, you were wrong. And if you thought he stayed with the buffaloes, you are right. The, this elephant decided that he would rather stay with the buffaloes. Okay, did you enjoy the story? Write to me. Khuda Fiz.